Welcome back, boys and girls. Women may be writing love letters to Jorge Nava as he counts down the final days of his sentence, but his real-world love life has been complicated. Jorge will divorce Anfisa before he dates again. Anfisa, meanwhile, already has a new man. Jorge Nava spoke about how he learned about Anfisa's new boyfriend and more during Monday's episode of 90 Day Fiancé Self-Quarantined. Where other stars has given fans tours of their homes, Jorge spoke to viewers from behind bars. One of the first things they had to deal with, he said to viewers about his incarceration. Jorge continued, was leaving my family and leaving my relationship behind. That was hard, Jorge expressed. That was very difficult. The last time I saw Anfisa was the day before I got incarcerated, he revealed. That is a truly stunning and miserable revelation. We all knew that she wasn't exactly visiting him every other day, but not once. The night before I came to prison, Jorge recalled, we had an argument. Jorge explained that they had a disagreement and things were not going well. I thought I was going to try to make things work, Jorge continued. And they didn't. That was it, he said with resignation, referring to his marriage. Probably about two months after I was in prison, Jorge detailed to viewers. He continued, she basically told me that she couldn't be with me anymore. She wished I got 12 years in prison, basically trying to get rid of me, Jorge recalled with sadness. Even if it's truly how you feel, that is a vicious thing to allegedly say to someone. We still talked on the phone, Jorge shared. I tried to work on the relationship no matter what, he added. I tried. Sometimes trying is not enough. Jorge is hardly the first to have his family fall apart while unjustly imprisoned, but that doesn't mean that it's less painful for him. On the upside, at the time that his part of the episode was filmed, Jorge was eagerly anticipating his release from prison in 26 days. His exact release date remains unknown and could always be impacted by the pandemic, as he has noted. But Jorge has spoken for months about his anticipation of being released in May, well ahead of his full two and a half year sentence. Once he's out in the world and free, Jorge told viewers he will be open to looking for love again. I feel like love is the least of my priority list, Jorge admitted. He explained his priorities because I just have to get my life together and make sure I'm good as a person. Jorge figures that he must do that before I am able to give somebody else something. He's right. Also, he must first divorce Anfisa, to whom he remains married in a purely legal sense. I ended up finding out through the internet that she was with somebody else, Jorge revealed. That definitely hurt. It really broke my heart, he expressed. The last time I spoke with Anfisa, he recalled, she asked me if I knew already that she was with somebody else. I told her I did know, Jorge described the conversation. And as soon as I get released from prison, I'm going to file for divorce. At least now I'm stronger mentally, Jorge affirmed. I'm stronger emotionally. I've gone through a lot of changes here in prison, he admitted. In addition to losing over 100 pounds, it sounds like he sorted out his thoughts and feelings about his wife. Their marriage had toxic elements long before Jorge's arrest. We wish him the best of luck and smooth, speedy release. That's it for now. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to stay tuned.